All right, so the celebration of Liberia's 177th independence continues here at the Centennial Pavilion. And of course, uh, culturally, Liberians are exercising the God gave idea given to them. I see a young man here doing something that is so, so uniquely done. I don't know what is that. I'm going to be asking a few questions to tell me what is it and then why he doing it the way he doing it. Uh, so my brother, uh, good morning, welcome. How are you doing? Okay. My name is Springs. Uh, what is your name? Vani Kane. Vani Kane. Uh, Mr. Kane, uh, how is the celebration here today? I see you here doing something important. But, but before we get to that one, let's talk about this day, 2060. How, how it looks at today? It's not bad, except that it is too rainy. Uh, yes, it's a rainy day. Okay, so tell me, what are you doing here? I see you doing homemade, that thing. Homemade country cloth. You are doing homemade country cloth. Wow. How are you doing it? I see, just I want you to tell me what each of those items doing there. For example, the one you put it in and put it out. What is that? This one is a thread, is a weaving regulator. Okay, the this weaving. This one is a divider. Mm -hmm. This one is the one we use to compact the thread. Wow. And so this one is a pair. Mm -hmm. It's a pair? Yeah. So you are pairing it? Yeah. And then what we use it to divide is, this one is a folder, we fold it close, we weave one on it. Mm -hmm. so, so how did you learn this thing? Uh, this thing. <laughs> it's I want to get a little history. Age old. old. It's age old. How long you been doing it? To, I'm from grade school. From, from grade school. school. Wow. Grade school. So how did you learn it? How it came about? Mm -hmm. well, if you have to trace the origin of living, mm -hmm. you can go as far back as the beginning of man. When it became necessary for man mm -hmm. to have clothes on. Right? Mm -hmm. Originally, we have the original thread, we call cotton thread, mm -hmm. which is there, okay, there, mm -hmm. we produce it. Mm -hmm. But my dress here is now, look at that now. So when it became necessary, when man became man, mm -hmm. he started to be dressed up. Mm -hmm. You know we are born naked. Mm -hmm. So when the requirement came, there was a stage, there were various stages of man growth. Mm -hmm. As you know it. Mm -hmm. The stone age, iron age, later age, etc. etc. So at the time man became man, mm -hmm. or homo, sapien, sapien, where he decided to walk, mm -hmm. his hands became useful. So he started to plant mats first, lie on. And later, he started to develop this through cutting. Through cutting. Cutting. The one for the bush? The people, were, the people were on their way going to do, perform ceremony. Mm -hmm. You know, our people used to, some of them, mm -hmm. ancestors used to go to the mountain to worship. Mm -hmm. Some worship trees, some worship mountains, mm -hmm. some worship rivers. Of course. The method of worship was, was unique to them. But in fact, in those days, you had to be more godly than you to be. So you have different, different beliefs. So when they were going, when I cut it from the sat down, the sat down, it's not in the breaking. But uh, when they saw the high mountain, the whole place is mountain. So we can talk to, we can talk to the creator of this mountain too, through this mountain. They sit by the riverside. While they were there, they said, well, we can talk to the creator of this river because it became impossible for them to know the river where it comes from, where it's going. It's not finished with where it's coming from. So they said that they can send messages on their way. That's how they saw this careful. Okay. Get it in the branch, you can split. Yes. You can see if you go in the door, you see it flying. I know that. Fine. There were the said, Then they started by spinning. Old people spin the thread. Mm -hmm. Of course, this is no longer the thread. Yeah. But we can still have it anyway. I know. So that is that is the origin. That is the origin. So how long you been in this business? Oh, I've been in this thing from grade school. Like I from grade school. So, how many years now? Uh, Maybe thirty. It's about thirty years. Thirty years old. Yes. And, and what, what? How does it this work contribute to your yes. well-being? Yeah. Uh, is, is it something that is? Is it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Each of this for today, mm -hmm. the one you see down there, mm -hmm. is two of these shirts of wood. Okay. The raw material that we sell, cut it out. Cut it out for the raw material? The raw material, yeah. Tell the US dollars? Yes. 
So the shirt that I see on you here, so if you prepare shirt like this, how much do you sell it? It's $50 for this, for this fixed like this. $50 US Yes. And they buy it from you? Yeah, I know. Like it is. I know that this is a raw material, and this is a finished product on you. Yes. Wow. So, uh, I mean, what do your customers tell you when they buy a shirt from you? Uh, I'm not going to show you how this agreement with the tailor. Oh, okay. But the feel that weaving, these are two professions, weaving is different from tailor. So it's it's, it's, a, it's a challenge for you a that the tailors will buy a raw material. Even the, the weaving. Mm -hmm. This is a cap that was first one. Now if you go down a little, you will see tailors around here. A pair like that weaving, and they are not weaving. They are different from the weaving. They are different from the weaving. They are different from Of course, they have finished the product, right? But we are the original maker. Oh no. Wow. How many are you in Liberia? Like, what, what is your size? Your numbers? Membership size or numbers? Are you you're blended? Because we blended. But you, do you have any? For this, in fact, all my brothers, young brothers, you have seen, this one is a female. They are all attending. This one is a female. This one is a female. The one behind you is also a female. Wow. And two days personally, you are also the only value of the ones. Yeah. It, it cannot be measured easily because, like, for me, uh, from high school, like I told you, I went to school, completed high school, went to college, LU, completed LU, I have a bachelor of art degree in sociology and the well, I believe that culture, if you a system without culture, obviously, it's like a cup of tea without sugar. What, what so is your... So we decided to, to, to maintain this culture so that, although they are spinning, they are living in those and everything, but they are the origin of it. Finally, sir, as I tell leave for you, what is your what is your plan? Uh, uh, having a team, uh, have a structure, maybe leadership, organizational structure, where you will take your grievances, like you saying the challenge you face with the tailor, well, the tailor got their own job to do too, and you got your own to do. So, what you think can be done that this will be kind of institutionalized? And, and you know, what and have a kind of structure. The approval we are looking at to approve and support, but we have National Weavers and Cotton Farmers Association of Liberia. Okay. And the National Secretary. Hmm. Oh, wow. Right? Mm -hmm. That is from, I mean, about seven or eight years. I mean, early time. Okay. We put that up, we have that organization, but we are left with accreditation. Okay. So we can start with our intention, our dreams are this thing, like when you ask me, I will tell you I'm from Lofa. Mm -hmm. Normally they start to look close. Mm -hmm. We are not expecting, we are not just from Lofa. Mm -hmm. This is from Liberia. Mm -hmm. And so we really have the intention of extending this thing down to the other countries so that we can also benefit. You know? But because we are overlooking this, you see dress code. How people dress code is appearing today because we feel that we can ignore our own culture and go ahead with another man own culture. So that is why you see even the idea of the, 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 the rate of rape can be increasing because people are half naked passing. But with this, you are decently dressed, and when you are decently dressed, obviously, you, know you, are, you, respected. you are respected. Yeah. And you know you are thank you, thank you, sir. I really enjoy my this, this interview with you. What is your name again, sir? My name is Vanny Thank you, Mr. Vanny Vikene. Yeah, so, 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 yeah, you said that. Uh,